ideal gas, perfect gas. A gas at your base boils low and charges strictly at all temperatures and pressures is called a perfect or an ideal gas. Ideal gas satisfies the relation PV is equal to mu RT. Here mu is the number of moles and R is the universal gas constant. R is equal to Na Kb. Na is equal to Avogadro number. Kb is equal to Boltzmann constant. The value of R is 8.314 joule mole inverse K inverse. Mu is equal to M by M naught is equal to N by Na. M is the mass of the gas containing N molecules. M naught is the molar mass. N is the number of molecules. Na is the Avogadro number. The ideal gas equation PV is equal to mu RT as mu is equal to M by M naught is equal to N by Na. We get PV is equal to N by Na, RT is equal to NKBT, which implies P is equal to NKBT, where N is number of molecules per unit volume. Real gas. The gas which your base boils low at low pressure and high temperature is called a real gas. When a graph is plotted taking gas constant PV by mu T, on y axis and pressure p on x axis it is noticed that real gas behaves as an ideal gas at low pressure and high temperature at low pressure and high temperatures the molecules are far apart and molecular interactions are negligible and the gas behaves like an ideal one but ideal gas doesn't exist in practice Boyle's law. We have ideal gas equation PV is equal to mu RT. Temperature T being maintained constant, we get PV is equal to constant. Therefore, Boyle's law can be stated as at constant temperature, pressure of a given mass of gas varies inversely with volume. A graph plotted across pressure P on y-axis and volume V on x-axis shows the comparison between experimental and the theoretical PV curves. Experimental curves are solid curves and theoretical curves are dotted ones. From the graph, Boyle's law holds good at low pressure and high temperature conditions.